Have you ever wondered why architects hate drone point clouds even though they look amazing? It's because when you send them a LAS file straight from your photogrammetry software, it won't open properly in Revit or Civil 3D. So clients end up asking, why I can't use this? What's wrong with this file? As a surveyor with over 20 years in the field, I've seen this mistake delay projects and frustrate clients again and again. So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly why point clouds don't work for architects out of the box in the simple workflow that fix it. When you export a LAS file from drone photogrammetry or LiDAR software, you're creating an unstructured point cloud. That means it's just a giant bucket of X, Y, and Z points with no scan position, no structure, and no indexing. And that's the problem. Revit or Civil 3D can handle that raw data. It either won't open it or uh, it crashes. So what's the difference? A structured point cloud like the ones from terrestrial laser scanners keeps information about every scan position, the angles, and sometimes the intensity of color. That structure makes it cleaner and easier for software like Revit to use. But an unstructured point cloud like the ones from the drones is just a million of points stitched together. Great for surveyors, a nightmare for architects. LAS is the standard file type for unstructured point clouds. It's perfect for survey and GIS software, but Revit and Civil 3D were never designed to read raw LAS data. That's why your client can use it. Here where Autodesk Recap comes in. Recap takes your LAS files and converts it into a RCP or RCS file. That format is structured, indexed, and optimized for Autodesk products. Think of it like a translator. Recap doesn't change your data, it just makes it readable for Revit, Civil 3D, or Navisworks. Inside Recap, you can import LS or LZ files, clean up noise, classify your point cloud, set up the correct coordinate system, and export to RCP or RCS file. That's it. Quick and simple. Now your architect can drop the point cloud directly into their model. Your client will thank you and you will avoid those frustrating conversations. Want to find out more tips like this? Join my free newsletter. The link is down in the description. And before you go, check out this other video where I show you a powerful software that extracts contour lines directly from your drone data. It's a huge time saver for anyone doing topos or earthworks.